Hi everybody, this is David Algadea Lab uh, and we just were asked to make a tiny video to show you how to quickly make worm picks uh, and the worm picks that we're going to make are made with exacto knives uh, this is based on Paul Sternberg worm gazette uh, pay, a publication that he got showing how to turn an exacto knife into a long lasting pick handle and the only thing that we're going to show you today that's different is how to use repurposed silver wire from old uh, electrophoresis boxes to make nice long lasting sturdy picks okay the silver is nice because it's soft so you students can punch things with it and it's soft you can reshape it and it won't break and it heats up very quickly and it cools down fairly quickly it's not like a platinum wire but you know if you count one two three it's cool enough to use and we're going to show you how to quickly make it so that you have a very nice flat and round tip on it okay so here's the stuff that we're going to need we need a exacto knife that we're going to take apart we need some aluminum foil that i flatten with my finger that we're gonna use to hold the, the silver wire. We need this duck bill forceps. Very important that they are really soft on the inside because we're gonna use them to squeeze the silver, okay? Uh, and the other thing that we need is a vise, which we have in a lab, in order to squeeze the wire in there. And that's gonna make that flat surface. So I have here, a piece of silver wire from an electrophoresis box and I'm just gonna cut the end of it can you see just to get a nice flat end okay the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hold that with my forceps Okay, and I'm gonna take this to the vise, have it, and now I'm just gonna crank this thing as hard as I can, okay? And now I'm gonna release it. Oops. And that's the tip. The nice thing about this is it makes it perfectly flat and round. So there is no sharp edges to hurt the worms. Uh, and so now we're just gonna fold this aluminum wire, aluminum paper to make like a little sandwich thing so that we can hold this wire. Uh, wire with it and that goes into the hole on the blade hole there just put in there tight voila all right so that's the pick I'm gonna put it in the microscope and either we take a picture with this phone right now or I'm going to upload a picture of what this looks like. I don't know if you can try and see through there. That's it. That's all there is to it. Good luck. You can make lots. We made like 10 yesterday in half an hour. All right, so good luck. Let us know if you have any questions.